Thanksgiving al fresco. If you must meet up with family, it's possibly the safest way to celebrate. Science has shown being outside lessens the risk of spreading COVID-19. WBZ's Nick Emmons met one family taking their dinner outdoors. The chairs are out and the tables ready to be set. Holidays have always been very important to us. Only this year, Thanksgiving dinner at Sarah McGoldrick's house isn't in the family dining room. So I started thinking, what would be a safe way that we could do something together? This year, dinner will be served outside in the family's backyard. We're standing here inside of a tent. Yep. Did you ever think you would be planning Thanksgiving dinner socially distanced inside of a tent in your backyard? I did not. Sarah says she got the idea to rent a party tent over the summer so her young children could spend some time with her father safely. My fear was that my kids weren't going to be able to see my dad really all winter. Sarah says there will be a total of 14 family members inside on Thanksgiving, which is within the governor's 25 person limit for outdoor gatherings. Everyone understands the policy about wearing masks and staying at their tables. Inside the tent, family members will be sitting at their own tables, socially distanced, six feet apart. If you're thinking about air circulation inside the tent, well, the sides will be opened up when dinner is served. All the food is single serve, all the drinks are single serve. Now, Sarah is the first to admit many families don't have the means or space to pull something like this off, but after a long year, she just wanted to do whatever she could to spend some quality time with loved ones safely. We will remember this year and how challenging it was to be this far apart and not be able to hug our family. Part of 2020 is looking for ways to find something that's better than nothing. In North Reading, Nick Emmons, WBZ News.